with my Data Engineering Academy, I basically have everything online that you need to become a data engineer or to get better at data engineering. A ton of courses with all the cloud platforms and all the tools you need and every data engineer needs. But if you want to go one step further and say, Andreas, I would like to have mentoring. I want to have personal assistance on my path as a beginner, but also as a professional to get better, then this coaching is something for you. Now, what are we doing in this six month program together with you? We are going to start and we're going to collect jobs that actually interest you. And with that, I'm going to create you a learning plan with everything that you need. Very often we're starting with fundamentals from the academy, small projects from the academy, and then you're building this out based on your interest and based on stuff that you like. To give you the help you need, you can join our coaching sessions every week where you can get one-on-one -on -one help from me and also my trainers and you can grow. This is a very cool way of you tell us your questions, we're going to answer your questions, but also not just yours, there are other people going to be in the session and so you can also learn from them and their questions. So this way you can together bring yourself up. Now, of course, what this coaching needs and to progress, one piece in this whole coaching program is that you also document your work so you can create a portfolio of your knowledge so that when you talk to people or when you send out your CV later, people can actually see what have you done, what do you know. Now, we help you with the project documentation, we also give you tips on that, but also we help you with the creation of the CV. We're going to go through the CV with you, we're also giving you tips on where to improve the CV so it's better for the companies to understand what you can do and how you can help them and how it can be beneficial to them. Now, let's talk about how this coaching program works week by week. The weekly coaching schedule is super simple. So we're going to begin in week one and two. First, we're going to do a kickoff meeting where everybody who is new in the coaching every month is going to come in. You all get to know each other and I'm going to show you around how to join the coaching sessions and how to access your Miro board and so on. From this point on, then I'm going to create you a learning plan based on your goals, based on your interests, a learning plan that you then can follow step by step and I can actually help you and we can actually help you reach this. To make sure that this learning plan is fitting to you, we're going to do together, you and me, we're going to do a one on one session, 30 minutes where we talk through it, where we modify the learning plan and make it perfect. After that, six months of weekly training for you. So the basis is you work on your project throughout the week, you come at least to one coaching session a week, you document your work, because the work that you've done is important for you, but also for your future so that people uh, know your reputation and know your portfolio and then you attend the coaching sessions. That is it. It's a cycle that you do every week. We repeat this. Of course, you can get help from me and from the other trainers throughout the week through our Discord server where you can just quickly type in the questions and we're going to help you with the questions. Now, how does such a learning plan actually look like? And I have an example for you here. The best way I found to work with you together is through interactive boards from Miro. Now, such a Miro board, what's going to be on this? First of all, there will be a job comparison that compares jobs that you've searched and your skills. Then there will be an accountability tracker for you where you can every week track your tasks and basically be accountable on these tasks. And also I can come in and can check your progress. Then apart for meeting notes and also questions you want to ask me or the other trainers. And then I'm going to create you a learning plan. This learning plan, I'm going to set goals for you, usually four or five goals. And then with these goals, like get into AWS, implement the lake house concept on AWS, learn Spark in Databricks, work with Snowflake DBT, and then use DBT with Databricks. Right? These are four goals for uh, this example student that I copied in here. And then you're going to get a step-by-step -step guide here four courses that you should do as preparation or as uh, the setup to reach your goals. Now, here, for instance, I said, okay, let's first do the basics. 
look into Python for data engineers because this person can already code and needs a bit more experience how to work with data. And then successful job application that will help with the CV, but also will help with example data sets that they can use then to improve the project and to go the next step. Platform pipeline design, uh, choosing data stores, and schema design slash data modeling. These are the basics. The next thing is API design, to understand at least the basics of API design and how to use APIs, and then go into the big data engineering on AWS project. And once this is built with the stream and the batch pipeline, on top of that, build a modern data warehouse and data lake infrastructure or the lake house infrastructure on top of this. Now, for instance, now this with this goal one, what the student then gets, I'm going to then build you here a pipeline so you can see, okay, these are the individual steps that you're going to fulfill, that you're going to work with. And then I build this for you for every goal. Here, this is for the lake house part with Redshift Spectrum and Athena S3 and QuickSight. And this is with Snowflake DBT. Here, Snowflake DBT, Power BI, S3, and so on. So I'm going to build you these and help you with actually preparing. And then you can go through this with the help of the Data Engineering Academy, where you're getting unlimited access, by the way, and you can build this. Now, once this project is built, then actually the most fun begins, because then you know how the platform works, you have set up everything that you usually use. And then we can start say, okay, let's modify this. Let's get a cool data set. Let's get a cool data source in the internet. Let's extract the data. Let's transform the data. Let's put the data in a data store and then work with it. Of course, if you are already an experienced engineer, then we can skip the first part of setting up the example project and do some really custom projects that are following your interests, your goals, and that will really challenge you. Yeah, I think this is the perfect way of actually teaching people data engineering or getting them better in data engineering, because this is unlike a bootcamp, not a step by step course that everybody has to follow through. This is customized on your needs, on your goals. And this can help you a lot. If you say, Andreas, I just want to have all the academy courses, everything, and always update. Check out the Data Engineering Academy. You can get 12 month access or unlimited access. And if you're already on the academy, you can easily upgrade to the coaching and we're going to refund you the amount of money that you already spend on the academy. So all the best and maybe we see each other in the coaching.